settlements in rural areas have always enjoyed a direct link with the surrounding natural environment. However, with rapidly depleting resources, many villages in India have entered into sustained poverty. In 2013, Amrita Vishwa Vidya Peetam, guided by its chancellor, Sri Mata Amritananda Devi, launched the Live in Labs program. We have made this program in, in such a manner that it has closely knitted the interdisciplinary, the interdisciplinary domains together to bring in the solution. We give the students an opportunity to see the rural community, be in that environment, in the rural community, along with them, live with them. So automatically, compassion will be generated in their heart, which provides them an opportunity to to find out what are the challenges they are facing and how their technical knowledge can be used to provide it as a solution. The Live in Labs program continuously strives to achieve the UN Sustainable Development Goals by fostering self-reliant communities. Bachelors, Masters and PhD students from all over the world can spend two weeks to six months working with Amrita faculty and students at one of the program sites. After a comprehensive orientation session and team formation, program participants will live in and explore the village to identify challenges and co-design a proposed solution. Implementation, evaluation and making improvements will happen after testing the solution in the university's labs. For any technological solution to be viable, to be sustained, you need to be with the community in designing the solution. That is one of the major things we train them in the whole process where they work with them in coming up with the design. They are look into it what is their needs so that they can come up with affordable, adaptable, sustainable solution which will make sure that the technological solutions be will become a success. The program draws on principles of human-centered design for the development and deployment of sustainable solutions in the areas of energy and environment by developing pathways to access renewable electrical energy, utilizing smart energy technology and encouraging sustainable practices to protect the environment and conserve natural resources. Water and sanitation. By designing micro water distribution and management systems, implementing water filtration systems, and fostering water wise communities. These are joined by initiatives in rural sanitation, which develop sustainable models for toilet construction fostered through democratic participation. Health and hygiene. By implementing hygiene awareness programs to increase community health and well-being, developing low-cost technologies, diagnosis units, micro-healthcare management devices, a rural health management system, and epidemic management and detection programs. Livelihood and skill development. By designing immersive training programs to acquire new skills, further developing existing skills and identifying alternative and sustainable income generation avenues, ensuring long-term viability. Education and gender equality. By encouraging gender equality in education through immersive technologies for language training, vocational training, after-school assistance and life skill training. waste management and infrastructure by exploring environmentally sustainable solutions for rural waste management such as waste to wealth initiatives 
and alternative affordable construction techniques from natural resources. Agriculture and Risk Management By designing innovative and smart technologies to promote efficient farming practices, developing techniques to enhance soil and crop quality, and implementing models and systems to map and identify environmental risks. Over the years, students from multiple universities around the world have come to Amrita to participate in various Live in Labs projects. India's villages are her life force and they need immediate care and attention. Societies are at their most resilient when knitted closely with threads of love and compassion. So join us and let us work together to develop self-reliant villages in India. Experience is the final evidence for knowing. Shraddha Van Lepte Nyanam